I have a very big family with around eight members in it. My grandparents, parents, my sister, uncle, aunt and me. They are wonderful people and I like all of my family members. My mother and father both are working employees. So I get to spend more time with my grandparents who tell me many stories about various things. We all eat our dinner together every day. My father and mother both work in the government sector and they tell us many things about their work. My uncle works in the private sector. My uncle is a gaming designer who teaches us many interesting things and shows us many new games. My sister goes to the same school and we have many friends in common. My grandfather is a retired police officer who is very strict and punctual about our daily work. He teaches us about disciples and makes sure we follow them. My grandmother is a housewife and prepares all of my favorite dishes. We always discuss our day while having dinner together. We go on various trips to many places. Once a month we go on a picnic and every six months once we go to different places. We celebrate every festival together with lots of sweets and our extended family also takes part along with us. Every week, Saturday and Sunday, we go with my father and uncle to play sports on the ground. They train us on many activities like running, volleyball and swimming. We all love each other, respect and care for each other's feelings. They teach me good lessons about unity, love and cooperation among ourselves. We pray to God every single day and wish everyone to have a good day. I feel that families are a blessing not everyone is fortunate enough to have. However, you have respect and care about every member of the family. It is not good to disobey them. Many people these days spend time away from the family in order to become independent. However, they do realize the importance of a family then. Families are really essential as they help in our growth and development. They establish us into a complete person with which we create our own individual identity. Moreover, they always provide us with a sense of security and this gives us a safe environment. We learn how to socialize from our families only and this will develop our intellect. Many studies show that people who live and stay with their families tend to be happier than ones living alone. Families are the only ones who always believe in us when the whole world doubts us. Similarly, when we are down and out of control, they are the first ones to cheer you up. Certainly, it is a true blessing to have a positive family by our side. In a society, a family is a social group of people who live together under the same roof. It contains of two or more individuals, such as parents and grandparents, as well as a small children who are linked by birth or blood. They are all referred to as family members. In a mutual relationship, each family member is committed to the other. A family occupies a unique position in both an individual's life and the society in which he or she lives.